the uh, Great Temple. I kept on calling it the Sky Temple. But that's the dark version of it. So, anyway. <sighs> we need to head over there and he will give us a new item. An item that we need to get like everything else. Alright, I'm not gonna go through this crap again. Alright, for screw attack. <laughs> Alright, blast away, and wow, I accidentally killed one of those things off. Open the frickin' door. Every time. Every time, too. Every time. Wait, wait a minute, what? Oh, there it is. Heading through the door. Gotta keep moving, moving. And... I don't know why I switched over to the other beam ammo. I'm still trying to comprehend that. Boom. There we go. Gonna keep on waiting there. Uh, excuse me, my zebra play. All right, so keep on going. Um. Do I hear like? Something for like the echo or some echo visor and see. So, I mean it's just it started making that noise and I was like getting worried. I hate walking by one of the statues, I'm afraid to like like come alive. I played this game enough to not get like scared of those things. Oh, I should not have got hit by that. That was crap. But hey, I can't control it, so I might as well just keep on moving along and get over my get over the sad sad truth. Oh, come on. And this at least it's not one of the dark ones. The Ink Smasher. Alright, opposite beam time. Things are a pain in the ass to kill. Oh, come on. I mean, like, either beam you use, it doesn't matter. Okay, we gotta use the light beam since he's using dark energy. No matter what beam you use, it's just gonna deal the same damage. I'm out of stuff. Yeah, that's all I'm gonna say. I'm out of stuff. I already know he's gonna use the light beam stuff. Okay, just die. I tried using my missiles and stuff. It didn't work out very well. Alright, time to continue. Yeah, I'm just gonna skip these things. They're not even really worth my time anymore. <laughs> I had 69 of those left. That was funny. Alright, time to move up. Move up in the world. Wait, 
what does that even do? Ah. Oh. Interesting. Does that mean there's an item up here? Um, apparently somewhere around here. So I'm just going to skip that item because I really don't know what it is and quite frankly I could care less. I'm about to run into a bunch of other items. Wait a minute. Can I make it? Ah, oh, forgot to jump. Well, I mean, I didn't really forget to jump, I just jumped a little bit too late. So in other words, I kind of forgot to jump, in a way. Yeah, I can make it. Less annoying stuff now, sweet. Continuing forth to the sky temple. I think we're gonna come to this sanctuary fortress for the rest of the Sky Temple keys. Um, oh, bitch. We'll come. Well, we'll definitely go there first. What's in here? Out of curiosity. Oh, I know what's in here. Does it make anything easier to get to? Okay, now it doesn't, so never mind. It's the, uh, missile module for the, uh, light beam. You guys are probably attempting to ask. No, there is not one for the Annihilator. You have the Dark Burst and the Sun Flare, I think? Sun something. Oh, wow, those things are actually pretty damn big. Is it through here that I go? Yep, it's through here that I go. So, yeah. <laughs> Going up an elevator doesn't even make any sense. They don't even have any of those like little stopper things. Okay, I hate these things. Fire missile for no apparent reason. Um, is it left or is it right? Oh, it's forward. <laughs> Neither. Okay, moving, moving, moving. Alright, he's about to go through this huge discussion, so it's gonna be Boar Central. Oh, wow. Why did they even put that there? Hooray for a long discussion. Yep, totally agree with that. Ooh. 
it's not even that difficult to kill. And there it is, the item that will actually help us get, get through a lot. More, a lot more than you think. The light suit. Trust me, it goes from badass suit to very okay suit. To say this, the light suit's not as cool as the dark suit. the badass light suit, I guess. Seems more mobile than the rest. But it's weird, though. Like, some of the things, like, that are on her, like, the backpack thingy that lets you propel through things, it's gone. So anyway, this will teleport us to the temples. Anywhere we want. Anywhere. But we're not gonna go anywhere. Because we're going to go through a certain order first. Quite frankly, I need to open up my guidebook because I don't remember where they're all at. The only reason why I like using the guidebook for this is because... I mean, for the first Metroid Prime, I, I didn't have the guidebook. so And it was easy to find them with like the little hints that it gave us. But the hints in this, you need two different hints to find it. Quite frankly, it's just... Stupid. I mean, you know, it's really idiotic. It's I don't know. I don't really know how to explain it because I mean it's just horrible. So yeah, I might as well give my go book now. I mean, I remember where a lot of the keys are, but a couple of them I'm still kind of eerie on with thought about, because, you know, it just skips my mind. So actually, let's go get one that I actually know of right now. Whoa, whoa, I didn't want to fall there. Get one that I actually know where it's at. It's in the Temple Grounds. Actually, I know where, both I know where all of them are in the Temple Grounds. It's not that hard to find them. Well, without the little helping thingy, it is. We don't need that. And plus, if, okay, let me explain a few things about the light suit. There are these dark Talon Metroid? I mean, that's just fun. Same rules apply with them. You freeze them with the with the uh, dark beam. And then you blow them up with a missile. Eh. Makes it so much easier. And what's this? Recording to the logbook. Looks like a overgrown Metroid. Sorry to say that. Um, where's the door? We need the Seeker Missile for this one. And it's... Oh, it's because I don't got a... It's because I don't got any uh, enough missiles. Well, that blows. Cause I kinda... Just die. Same rules apply in Metroid Prime 1. You kill it with this power bomb. Well, you can kill it with a power bomb. 